Psycho Mantis reads two things, your playstyle and your memory card. On your playstyle, he'll judge three things, your alerts, your deaths, and the amount of times you've died to pitfalls. He has two potential lines for alerts, four potential lines for your deaths, because while he only has a positive or a negative assessment, he has unique lines for each combination. Same thing with the two lines related to your ability to avoid traps. However, because the game only seems to take into account traps that instantly kill you, it's basically impossible to be negatively viewed in traps without also being negatively viewed for your skills as a warrior, resulting in a total of six possible voice combinations for the last line. Now, let me read your mind. No, perhaps I should say your past. You are a very methodical man. The type that always kicks his tires before he leaves. You are a highly skilled warrior, well suited to this stealth mission. You are extremely careful of traps. You are either very cautious, or you are a coward. You are a very methodical man. The type that always kicks his tires before he leaves. And yet you are rather ineffective in battle. It seems that you are careful with traps. Still don't believe me. You are a very methodical man. The type that always kicks his tires before he leaves. And yet you are rather ineffective in battle. And you need to beware of traps as well. Still don't believe me. You're a careless man, aren't you? However, you are a skilled warrior. You like brute force. You are extremely cautious around traps. Still don't believe me. You're a careless man, aren't you? And you are a poor warrior as well. However, you are skillful at eluding traps. You're a careless man, aren't you? And you are a poor warrior as well. And the same goes with traps. For reading your memory card, Psycho Mantis has five lines in the American version. Still don't believe me. Now I'll read more deeply into your soul. Ah, I can see into your mind. So, you like Sui Coden. So, you like Azure Dream? You like Castlevania, don't you? You enjoy role-playing games. I see that you enjoy Konami games. The conditions for these lines are having Sui Koden data on your memory card, having Azure Dreams data on your memory card, having Castlevania Symphony of the Night data on your memory card, having two or more RPGs from a list of Konami games, having three or more games from the list on your memory card. Apparently in the Japanese version there was also the line you enjoy Kojima games followed by Kojima himself saying thank you for all your support. Since that one also read Snatcher and Police Knots data from their PS1 ports. We'd have to wait about 16 years to get a version of this. You did it. You erased all the markings. But every one of them will always be with you. You seem to be a fan of Hideo Kojima games. Thank you for all your support. The Konami games that influence these lines are restricted to four games. The three previously mentioned PS1 games and the unmentioned Vandal Hearts. Vandal Hearts is strange in that it's basically an invisible game. It's not explicitly mentioned by Mantis, but does influence the lines he says. I tested multiple saves from Konami games such as Police Knots and ISS Soccer. Not only are there no lines for these games, but they can't even trigger the Konami games line. Vandal Hearts is also a role-playing game, meaning that it can influence some of the lines Mantis says. In this example, Mantis mentions the same games, but only one of them gets the You Enjoy Konami Games line. So, you like Sui Koden. So, you like Azure Dreams? You enjoy 
enjoy role-playing games. I see that you enjoy Konami games. You have not said often. Similarly, both of these videos only explicitly mention Suikoden, but only one of them expressly says you enjoy role-playing games. So, you like Suikoden? You enjoy role-playing games? You have not said often. You are so wonderful. The final layer to this, and the easiest one to control, is the amount of saves that you've done. Mantis has two different lines depending on how many times you've saved. The threshold seems to be around nine. You like Castlevania, don't you? Hmm. You have not saved often. You are somewhat reckless. I can read you. Hmm. Your memory is completely clean. You have saved often. You are a prudent person. So for a cutscene that's less than a minute long most of the time, there's a lot of layers to this. Thanks for watching, and I'd like to thank Felipe Flower for inspiring this video by pointing out that Vandal Hart's line is not actually the one that is, uh, you enjoy role-playing games.